What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here. Going to bring you a you know favorite song of mine, acoustic version. Uh, so we'll zoom in. I'll show you the uh, you know little tricks and chords and rhythm and all that stuff. I think it'll be fun. It's a great song to be able to know how to play. And also, I appreciate all your support by subscribing to this YouTube channel, liking the video, leaving comments. You know all that stuff. It helps me a lot, and I really appreciate you taking that journey with me. So thank you so much. But enough of that. Let's zoom in. We'll break this one down. Here we go. All right, so let's play a D minor chord, but with the pinky on the third fret of the B string. First fret on the high E, and then middle finger on the second of the, of the G, because we're gonna go. So open A, third fret of the A, then the open D, and it's the chord. Then we get that ring finger on that third fret of the A string again. And then this could be considered one of the hardest bar chords. It's a B flat major. And I'm barring the first fret, and then ring fingers covering the third of the D, G, and B. Um, you could totally get away with playing a power chord, which would be one, three, three. So it's the B flat major. And then C, 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 D again, A, C, D, or the open A, third fret, D minor, da, 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 ba, 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 da, ba, da, da, ba, ba, So then, when we get to the verse, we play the open A, oh, third fret, bah, with our index finger, and then a half step up, which is, that's a C sharp note, it's the fourth fret, and we're going to play a minor seven bar shape here. That's C sharp minor seven. So that's barred on the fourth fret. And then we've got the sixth of the D and the fifth of the B, and I'm barring it. And I take that little shape and scoot it up a string, and that would be called G sharp. Now that's the root, and that's G sharp seven. So C sharp minor seven to G sharp seven. C sharp minor. And then C, D, E, all major. Um, he's playing bar chords. And uh, actually, I think he's playing an E7 chord. You can play E major or E7, and you can uh, add a little suspended there on the second fret of the G. So check it out. O, two, oops, sorry. O, three, four, C sharp minor seven, G sharp seven. C sharp minor seven, C D E major or E seven. So that time I did C D E because that's easier. But I think he was going. So you can do that, or you can do. 
going to survive either way. Oh, three, four, minor seven, two, regular dominant seven, minor seven again, C, D, E major, minor. We'll play it just regular without talking. So we'll, we'll get to that. So the next section that you need to learn is F sharp minor. So we're barring the second fret and playing an E minor looking shape to B major, which is just like that B flat, but it's barred on the second fret. And that's covering the fourth of the D, G, and B. So F sharp minor to B major, E major or E7, E to A, and you can play sevens for those because it's like a bluesy song. Um, I'll keep them regular, but you can play them as dominant seven chords. So. F sharp minor, B, E to A. F sharp minor, B, then the E. So what happens is it goes lay low. It's an A minor chord or just an A note. Lay low. As a transition in back into the chorus. So F sharp B, E to A. F sharp B to the E. A do. All right, that was the lesson. I uh, hope you learned a little something, maybe had some fun even. I hope you did. Uh, thanks for subscribing to this channel. This is where I'm going to be from here on out. Uh, liking the video, leaving comments, following me on social media. The list goes on and on, but I do really appreciate it. It helps me a lot. So thank you so much. And uh, can't wait to see you again in another lesson real soon. So we'll see you there. Take care.